In this video, I will show you how to install Ionic app in Angular. Open this website ionicframework.com and go to the docs section, click on the installation. And here you will find all of the commands. Uh, first of all, you need to see if uh, you have Ionic CLA installed or not, or not. So for that, type Ionic. You can see that it is saying that command not found. So first of all, you need to copy this command and install Ionic first. So paste it and press enter. This would take some time and install the angle Ionic CLI for you globally and after it is installed we can use it all right you can see that ionic cli has been installed successfully now if you want to verify just type ionic dash dash version if it gives you the version, then that's mean Ionic has been installed successfully. To create a new Ionic project, type Ionic start and press enter. Here it is asking you a question that if you want to use the app creation wizard or not. If you press Y, then the, it would open a URL in your browser where you would be able to use a UI interface to create your first project but if you press n then it would allow you to create that project through the command line so we would try both options so in the first attempt i'm going to try the ui for that i will type y and press enter you can see that it has opened this nice ui where you can uh, select all of the options that you want to specify for your first ionic application here you need, you need to type the name of the app, my test app. And uh, here you can specify the theme that you want to prefer and here select the basic layout that you want to choose. And at the bottom you can see we have three options, React, Angular and View. As we are talking about Angular, so we have to pick the Angular framework from this list and click on the continue button. Here it is asking you to create an account. If you don't have an account already, then uh, uh, create a new account from here. So click on authorize to give it permission. Okay. I have logged in and uh, now uh, it is saying that your app is now building in your terminal. So let's see. Yes. In the terminal, the app has started to be created. And it would take some time after it is done, we would be able to test it in our term terminal. Okay, the Ionic app has been installed successfully. Now we need to go to the folder where we created the app. And in this folder, you can see all of the files are available now. And I'm going to open this 
project in the VS code for that type open space dot oh, sorry not open instead of that I would type code dot so here you can see that this is an angular project with the Ionix in it so now it's time to run the Ionic in the browser for that. Open the terminal app Ionic Sun. All right, you can see that Ionic app is now running in my local server and it is uh, fully functional e even if you reduce the screen size it would be responsive like it should be so you can see that ionic app is now functional and it is built with the angular app so you can use your angular knowledge to uh, build your app now next uh, uh, if you want to build uh, create this project by using the CLI, if you don't want to use the UI, then just delete this project and create it again. Let's try that and see if it is working in that way. Okay, once again, I'm going to type Ionic start the center and it is asking me again the same question that if I want to use the creation wizard this time, no, the center. And now you can see it is asking me some questions that if which framework I want to use as we want to use angular, just stay in angular and press enter. Here it is asking me the project name, I would say Ionic angular and press enter now it is asking asking me that which template do you want to use i want to use the side menu template or maybe this time let's try the tabs or press enter give it some time Okay, the app is uh, created now. Let's test it again like before. Copy this command, go into that folder. You will, you will see all of the files are available again. And then now it's time to run this application. For that type, Ionic, serve, press enter. And this would be open in your local server, in your browser. Right, you can see that now it is working fine like before. The tabs are working correctly, so that is really nice. All right, guys, thank you for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get all of the notifications. And also, please like and share my video.